Hi, Dennis Dodd here from CBS Sportsline at the ACC Media Days at the beautiful Pinehurst Resort. And yes, I am talking about Pinehurst, the legendary golf course is here. And joining us from the ACC Media Days is the great defensive tackle from Florida State, Andre Fluellen, who's trying to try to lead the Seminoles back from a 7-6 and six season last year. Andre, what are the prospects, do you think, for the Seminoles this year? Um, I've seen us having a great season this year. Just uh, got a lot of energy, a lot of excitement about this season with the new coach and staff and all that. So I'm just looking for great things from Florida State. You don't beat many guys in college football, major college football, who are creative writing majors, English lit majors, which this guy is, and also his favorite class is Greek mythology. Tell us about that. Tell us about your major and where you went ahead with it. Um, like right now, I'm just trying to. Uh, I want to do sports journalism when I'm done. So. Uh, that's one thing I'm really looking forward to after, you know, hopefully playing in the NFL, doing that. And uh, to be honest, I don't know how I got started with Greek mythology. <laughs> just, uh, just started reading about it, just wanted to take the class. And this is an interesting class, man. It's just a lot of interesting stuff. Well, that, this interview is going to have to end right now if he's going to be in sports journalism trying to take our jobs. But let's we'll talk about FSU. A lot of changes this year. All the new coaches. Uh, something had to change, I assume, from last year after another what is considered a down year for the Seminoles. Um, what has to happen this year for you guys to be successful? And you think you can get back on top of the conference? Um, just had to take every game one by one. I mean, just uh, going, we've got a tough game against Clemson off, off the backhand. So just win every game one by one, see the do the best we can, and just, uh, just hope for the best, man. We just need some breaks more than anything. Just, you know, getting lucky every now and then. That's, that's the difference between the national championship and, you know, losing three games. Two things. Uh, last year, I, I asked you this inside was the Wake Forest game last year pretty much rock bottom, 30 to nothing loss at home. And then number two, how big is the Clemson game this year kicking things off? A conference game, uh, which go, is huge towards the conference race. Um, like I said, Wake Forest was definitely rock bottom for us. Just, uh, I mean, not only getting beat, but getting you know, shut out at home, you know, on national television. And then, uh, you know, playing against Clemson at first, I mean, that's just, I mean, it's a big rivalry game, you know, the Bowden Bowl. But then again, it's still an ACC game. So we have to, you know, win that in order to get to our goal, which is ACC championship. Does, does Miami and or FSU, do you think, have to be good for this league to be considered a top league because that's really why this league was formed because of the juice you you two teams brought to this league yeah i mean i'd say from the inside looking out i'd say so i mean uh, a lot i mean a lot of the fans a lot of the media just look at just want to have one highlight team you know from east conference and be like oh that's a great conference but you know, it's not fair for, you know, Wake Forest or Georgia Tech or the teams like that, you know, or Virginia Tech for the team who, like, Wake Forest won the ACC championship but not getting the credibility saying, oh, well, the ACC just had a bad year. That's why they won it. But that wasn't the case. I mean, it's just a competition. The level, I mean, the, the conference has just gotten that much higher. Tell us about your process, why you came back, what went into the decision, and, and why you wanted to come back as a senior. Um, I mean, the main reason I came back was just to help build a legacy for Florida State. I mean, just there was a lot of uncertainty to where, you know, where I was going to go, what round, you know, where I was projected. So I really wasn't, you know, I wasn't really set on that. wasn't wasn't really uh, didn't didn't have too much confirmation about that. So I uh, just want to come back and just help out the team, do my best, and then you know do, go through my senior year, and then whatever happens, just happens. All right, we got this far. I got to ask about Bobby because we haven't even asked about Bobby yet. How is Bobby Bowden? Is he the same? Is he more feisty? How has he changed? Uh, yeah, Bobby Bowden's the same. Coach <laughs> Bowden is going to be the same today, tomorrow, whenever. Coach Bowden is never going to change. He's like a rock, man. But, I mean, you know what to expect from him. Hey, Andre, thanks a lot, and good luck this season. Live from the ACC Media Days, this is Dennis Dodd along with defensive tackle, FSU's Andre Fluellen.